Earlier this week, Penn State football coach James Franklin said, quote, teams all over this country are the purest form of humanity that we have. We don't judge. We embrace differences. We live, we learn, we grow, we support, and we defend each other. We're a family, end quote. Sounds like an apt description of Perrysburg in this week's Mercy Health Unsung Player of the Week, sponsored by the National Football Foundation in conjunction with the Northwest Ohio Football Officials Association. Yellow Jackets senior wide receiver and defensive back Matthew Snyder is this week's recipient. He caught a pass in Perrysburg's 49-10 win over Southview last week, but his story is much more than just that. Snyder has learning disabilities as well as some physical limitations, but that hasn't stopped him from becoming an important part of Matt Kriegel's program. You see, Snides is the hype man. He gets the fans fired up on Friday nights, and during the week at practice, helps his teammates any way he can. Well, he's a great teammate, first and foremost. The kids really love him. Um, he's a fun kid to be around. He does everything that you want in the off season, the weight room, conditioning, workouts, everything. And in practice, he comes to practice every day. He functions, does everything that everybody else does. Uh, he's one of those guys that just does his part every day. It felt pretty good to get my first um, varsity football catch. I have what's called an IEP where it makes um, my brain go a little slower, makes my functions move a little slower, but other than that, I just don't let it fade me and just keep going. Well, yeah, we were fortunate enough to get a lead. Um, yeah, we knew we wanted to get some seniors in, and it was a running clock situation. So you're kind of going fast, figuring out who you can get in there and when you can get them in. And we call the specific play that we run every day. I, Matt knows his routes. He knows what he's doing. We knew he'd go to the right place at the right time. And he got the bounce off his chest and bottled it a little bit and caught it, and the kids went crazy. It was a lot of fun. It's like it's in slow motion. You're thinking, come on, man, just hang on to that thing. And then he hung on to it and fell out of bounds. And, you know, everybody kind of jumped on top of him. When I got him on his feet, he looked like he was about ready to fall over. So it was, it was a great mo moment for him and the team. Yeah, I was standing on the sideline. I was right on that sideline. It, it hit his chest pretty hard, and I was like, oh, hang on. He had the same scenario in a JV game a couple years ago where he bobbled it, and you know, he's got the bobble catches down apparently.